All right, we are recording. Are you paying attention? Or are you gonna be on your phone now? Or when you said you're ready to live record? Texting. Oh, that's nice. Texting what? Responding to texts. All right, calm down. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. So what's going on? Well, our tech is taking a dump today and we have tried for 15 minutes to try and I know you like my wording to try and fix it. Um, it's just not happening. So we're going to record this show, which goes against Craig likes to record. I don't because Craig likes to stop and restart, but um, so we're going to record this show and post it to you guys. I'm start sorry. over. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> You're so funny. It's not happening. So I think we are in week 10 of COVID updates a little bit. Yep. Right? It's been a, uh, it's been a weird time for real estate agents, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Some of some, it's like hit or miss. You're either super busy or just wishing for something to do. Yeah. Uh, and we apologize for missing last week. Um, I think we just both were not in the headspace to do the show last week. We both call each other and we're like, mm, yeah, nope. I'm good. Yeah. Last week was kind of like, it's still going on. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. It was, it was a, uh, I don't know. And you know what, honestly, I hit the wall last week. Last week was a rough week for me. I think, I think it was like the cabin feeder caught up to me and yeah. I'm usually pretty, pretty positive and stuff like that. But last week I just, you know, I look back now and I'm like, man, that was just a rough week. Like, yeah. I was over it last week. So this week has been much better. I think we both yeah. needed that regrouping for this week. Um, yeah. yeah, I've been trying to get out and walk and, you know, talk to friends and do some other stuff to help keep me, uh, get me boosted back up here a little bit. So, but yeah, anyway. Mother's Day this weekend too. Yes, yes. Quick shout out to all the moms out there. Yeah, happy Mother's Day, guys. I, I was telling Chris, I'm like, you know, Mother's Day is Sunday, right? He's like, yeah, and I'm like, whatever. <laughs> I used to always tell my ex-wife, you're not my mom, but <laughs> whatever. again, she's my ex-wife, so. <laughs> I'm sure All you right. still made sure that your sons did something nice for her. I did. I did. Okay, good. I did. They always do. I All even right. call them now. I'm like, hey, Sunday's Mother's Day. You guys better do something nice for your mom. <laughs> So we've got, we've got some updates for you guys, and we're going to get into it because Nicole will ramble on forever and not go anywhere with this, right? Oh, yeah, that's me. I'm the rambler for sure. Can, can everyone see the big glare on her screen? I guess that's yes. all I can focus it's on. Like, <laughs> it's right here. See it? I'm drawing it with my finger. I decided to clean my video camera, and now it's like glaring from the light up there. Yeah, it's way Clean worse than her camera. Up. Guys, she licked her finger and touched the touched her her camera so now no, her whole rubbed, computer i didn't lick it first i just rubbed it on there whole computer has covid now <laughs> no it doesn't her, because i don't have antibodies to covid we already her, her labrador top had her labrador lab lab laptop, laptop, top lab top. Oh, it's so goofy all right so first thing we're going to talk about is we're, we're these are just a couple fun updates i think but next week at at Ganire or, or through a Zoom meeting, we are going to have a virtual happy hour. Uh, the member involvement committee is putting that on. It's pretty cool. So we're going to be we're going to be doing that. Dress dress cool, business attire maybe. I don't know. I'm going to get dressed up from the waist up anyway. I'll just wear probably sweats. It'll be the new Zoom meeting, uh, you know, outfit. Just don't um, stand up. Just don't stand up. You yeah, yeah. On, like you got like I should do something video. funny. I should do something funny, like all those Zoom fails that you can see now, like of people not remembering that they're on video on the Zoom. So you have like a tuxedo top, and then you get up, and it's like sweatpants. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, like a snuggie on. Just tidy whities. Oh no, no, we didn't need to go there. No. <laughs> well, that's what that one guy did. It was awesome. It was funny. Yeah. So was... anyway, so that's May fourteenth. It's next Thursday. And it's going to be at 4.15, I believe, is when it starts. So that's going to be cool. Yep. Uh, feel, free to, feel free to bring an adult beverage or something like that. That'll be, uh, that'll be acceptable for that. Yeah. Um, yeah, sounds like so, a good time. Yeah, so I think that's going to be a lot of fun. And, and uh, I'll be there and, and other people will be there. It's going to be fun. I'm glad it's just not going to be you and there will be other people there, Craig. I know, right? <laughs> Me too. <laughs> so 
Next item of business. What do you think, Nicole? What are we going to talk about? What's well, Ganiar doing? Uh, I think free CE at Ganiar, right? So, yeah. um, for those, especially with you know how things are going, some people are really slow. So it's awesome that Ganiar is offering some free CE. So if you haven't done your CE yet and you don't want to pay for it, free is always good. Um, check out Ganiar's calendar, and they have ten more free slated classes before June 30th. I think they may have canceled a couple of them, but if you look on their calendar, they have, a, you know, at least five, five to 10. I don't know. Sarah said they, that I think they did reschedule a couple because of uh, instructor couldn't make it or something like that. Okay. Yeah. But so. Free C, the price is right. I know, right? <laughs> yeah. Um, so yeah, you can look on Ganire's calendar or reach out to one of us or Sarah at Ganire. They can, anyone can help you there too. So so moving on to the state stuff. So that's what Ganire is offering right now. Um, we have some really awesome updates from the state. Um, so awesome. Yes, I know, right? So if you guys haven't looked yet, there's a website called backontrack.in.gov. And this has all the updates for everything that's going on with small businesses right now. Um, the most exciting one I called Craig about, I know, I like my hands. Um, yesterday it was, did you say, I know I like my hands. Yeah, I like to talk with my hands. Okay, all right. I, like all right. Um, I called Craig yesterday. They're offering free PPE. So if you, the state of Indiana, so if you are registered as a business with the state of Indiana, um, like an LLC or something like that, you can S get free PPE. Whatever. So if you have one to 50 employees, you get 50 masks, a gallon of hand sanitizer, um, a few bottles of a smaller hand sanitizer and you get 10 face shields. So for larger brokerages out there, if you have more employees, you can, there's tiered levels for that. But for most of us, we're probably going to qualify for the first level and it's free. So go on that website. Um, if you go on the back on track.in.gov and it's slash PPE marketplace .htm. We'll post it in the comments once we get done too. Um, that you can get some free PPE, um, which is kind of awesome. I'm not going to lie with everything going cool. on right now. So very cool. Yeah. So that's my most exciting update. What, what do you got, Craig? Well, you're don't, Hey, you still gotta, you still gotta hold out for the, the EIDL loan stuff, uh, because I don't really know anything about that. So I'll let you talk about that as well. <laughs> but, um, the PPE stuff is fantastic. And, and if you don't have masks and sanitizer and things like that, and you're not a corporation, um, you know, reach out to someone. We can, we can probably figure out how to help get you some or something like that. I don't know. Probably yeah, not sure. actually. Because so. I think the safest way everybody's talking about is you wear a mask, the other person wears a mask, and the transmission level is very low, right? As long as you guys maintain yeah. social distancing. So the mask thing is really important right now. Um, reach out, I would guarantee you that we can find some people that um, have some extra hand sanitizer or something, or masks or whatnot. I know I ordered a bunch for my team, but they're not here yet. I will, I will say this too, Amazon started, I think they start, well, I know they started shipping stuff again, and I ordered a 50 pack of like disposable masks that, that I can wear. They're not like the medical grade, you know, whatever, but it was like 30 yeah. bucks for 50 of them. And then they're disposable, so I can bring them on showings. If a, if a client doesn't have one, I can offer them one. Ironically, they are made in China, so they may be virus masks already. I may get it from Get them. out of here. Don't say that. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, so I think the mask thing is really important. Um, lots of people are doing cloth masks. I see it all over Facebook Marketplace. They're super cheap. Um, I wear a cloth mask most of the time. Um, disposable, I really feel like, most of my agents have cloth masks, so disposables are really for probably clients and sellers. Um, so just make sure that you're wearing one. That's the best advice I can give you. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I think it's, I think it's a smart, just a safe move. Yeah, for sure. And I don't have to trim up my, I don't have to trim up my little facial hair anyway, so that's Dude, good. That's got COVID. There's COVID in your beard everywhere. There's not COVID in my beard. My beard got tested. It's fine. <laughs> Um, all right. All so right, talk to us got? about this EIDL loans. All right. So EIDL, they, I got my EIDL loan two weeks ago. So, um, if you applied, like when it first started, you should see some of that stuff going in. 
everybody's getting a thousand dollars off the top. There's extra hoops to jump through to get the extra nine. That thousand, I believe, is a grant, um, but the extra nine is a loan. So um, you have to sign up with a small business administration to get that extra, but the interest rate I think is like 3%. Um, and it does not say exactly what you have to use it for, like the other things do. So it's kind of nice. It's a nice low interest loan for anybody who needs anything right now, paying credit cards or doing anything like that. Um, so take advantage of that money. Oh, don't tell people to borrow money to pay credit cards. Oh, that's terrible. No. I'm just saying in general, if you have debt that you are having a problem paying right now, that could be something that would help you. Anything else? What, what, what else you got to say negative? Negative. Nothing. Oh, okay. Just check it. Just check it. Just not paying attention. <laughs> Whatever. You're supposed to be paying attention during the show. All right. So I think what is our last thing we have? Pandemic unemployment assistance is starting to pay out now. So you should have received, um, you should have received something by that by now. Yep. I think both Craig and I got something deposited today, right? Yep. Um, make sure you're checking your accounts. Um, I've seen several people online saying they're having issues, like they'll get paid for a week or two and then they're having issues. Um, so hopefully going forward, things will smooth out a bit with some of that. So yeah. honestly, it's all good news this week. There's nothing. It is kind of all good news. And, and oh. even Indiana is starting to open. We we're going to talk about that a little bit That's too. We we're going to talk about. Yep. What is it? Restaurants and stuff are 50% next week, I think. Yep. Starting the 11th restaurants and retail are 50%. You can social gather 25 people or fewer as long as you're social distancing. Um, BMV. Now, Nicole, when they say you, when you said they're going to open by 50%, does that mean that like if you go there and order a sandwich, they're only going to give you half of it, like half a glass of water? Like yeah, how, that how does that 50% work? Yeah, that is what I mean. Oh, nice. Just I kidding. I'm going to go with that now. That means that they can, that means they can fill their restaurant or retail 50% capacity. So if, you know, by law, they're allowed 500 people, they can only fill it to 250 people and they have to social distance, you know, every other table or whatever. Um, to try and keep everybody safe. So um, that is really good news because I know I would bet that the restaurants are going to be flooded around here. I know myself, I'm sick of doing dishes, you know, doing my dishwasher twice a day because you're cooking breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, so I'm sure there'll be lots of people that'll be happy to um, start going out to restaurants and doing that kind of thing. So BMV and travel is also open 50%. I haven't read much up on the BMV of how that's going to go. Um, I don't know if it's by appointment only or how that works, but, um, and they are recommending masks right now. I think through stage three, I think is recommended masks. Stage four is when it's optional. So. Excellent. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. But yeah, so that's like exciting. Those, I'm excited. Yeah, I am too. I, I, I would love to get back to kind of the way things were and all that kind of good stuff. I don't know if they'll ever get back to exactly the way they were, but no, it's but okay. at least things are starting to open up now. I'm hoping that the social distancing that we've all done and we've all worked really hard at staying home and things like that. I'm hoping that this really pays off with everything opening back up. So I'm Definitely. having a positive outlook on it all. It's all yeah. positive week. It's positive. It's all COVID positive. Week 10. week 10. Finally. It's a positive COVID update week. We yeah. like it. I love it. I love it. Yeah. I'm excited about it because I'm I was tired of the other stuff for sure. We got free CE, we got free masks, we got we got free money, we got free happy hours. Except it's not free, just you know, do it yourself. But anyway, <laughs> it's it's a great week. Yeah, I think overall, for sure. And minus this cold snap that we're gonna have today, mm. the weather was getting awesome. It was yes. beautiful, the sky has been blue, the grass is green. I'm loving it. Yes. So, you know, we'll, we'll post those websites in the comments after we post this non-live on Facebook, which I'm super sad about, but tech is what it is this week. I know. Um, we'd love to see you all. We like to hear your comments and respond to them during the show. So hopefully next week uh, we will get this fixed and my internet will cooperate so that we can. I don't think it's your, I think it's, I think there was an issue with the streaming issue. I don't think it's your computer. Yeah, hopefully. Look at me sticking up for my co-host. Oh, uh, that's so nice. You know, let's, we'll put this in the books because that's not normally how that is. So yeah, 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 yeah. 
All right, well, guys. thank you, everyone. We Sorry can. we couldn't talk to you guys live and all that, but uh, Nicole will read the comments. I don't really get on Facebook much on the weekends. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Or ever, hardly. He's too cool for Facebook. It's fine. No, I just, you know what? I just, I just don't think it's going to catch on. <laughs> <laughs> You're funny. All right, guys. Awesome. Thanks for watching. We will see you next week. Have um, a great week. Have a great week. Stay safe out there. Bye. Bye. How do I figure it out?